All right, guys, welcome back to the next video on the channel. And today, what we're going to be going into is the Ultra League once again to try and get our level as high as we can, as this is the best league we kind of are in at the minute with Pokemon wise. So, let's try and smash this league and get to level 20. And the Pokemon we're bringing in is Swampert. Um, then, we're going to bring in Polyrath instead of Annihilate just to give it a bit of a switch up. And then, Giratina for the swap out basically to make it tanky and be able to take down any other dragon that we see so let's get straight into this with the first fight um i will be looking at the screen so maybe it doesn't look like i'm looking at the camera so i do apologize like i said there is a new thing for me to have a camera in front of me so i am trying to learn at the same time um but let's get this win tour terror not a good start like in the slightest this is not a good start we are quad weak to grass so that is not a good start at all however we do have a ghost move on the meta ghost so we should be okay with that um but let's see where we get up to obviously that does nothing to meta ghost at all and um, we are going to just block this because we are going to take this meta ghost down without even using a dragon um dragon claw which means then we should have two left Obviously, it does have Meteor Mash, so I want to try and get him to use a shield. And if he doesn't, it's a free Pokemon down for us. We've only one shield used. And there we go. That's exactly what we wanted. Can we use the second shield? Dragon Claw is a very quick move, so I would be surprised if he does shield here. Oh, wow, he did. Um, I'm not going to. I don't know what moves it's got. Play Meteor Mash. Yeah, it did do a lot, but not what I thought. Now, the issue we have here is obviously Tor Terror will have Frenzy Plant soon, so we will have to block that. Now, I think he's going to try and get to the next move, like the next Pokemon, which is fine. Swampert's its next Pokemon. See, that's a strange one. So. He's swapped out. That's so bizarre. Now, I'm going to have to use my shield here. Just because we will get, like, a lot taken out of us. The only thing I can think of doing is swapping out soon when we've got a Hydro Cannon. And trying to beat that Tor Terror to a move. Um... Let's see what happens. So our Swampert's nearly got it. Um, I'm tempted to go to Polyrath. Yep. I'm going to Polyrath here. Obviously, we are going to take this down. It just means we're a bit faster to an Icy Wind. I should have actually... Oh, that's going to kill us, isn't it? A Frenzy Plant. From sand tomb really that's very bizarre friendly plant should be the movie used there but never mind I have noticed by the way um, in PvP at the moment even if the move isn't blocked it's coming up saying blocked so worth it I mean we still won that fight this team is um, not OP, it does lose to dark types. Um, that's why I swapped the Annihilate out, Annihilate out for the Polyrath to see how much difference this made. And we're doing okay. We're not doing too bad. We are weak to grass now. That's the only issue. Clefable. Oh, and one of the most annoying Pokemon in the entire game is still the most annoying for me. Togekiss. I, we have nothing for a Togekiss. That is the one bad thing we need to look at when doing these battles, is trying to figure out a way to take down a Togekiss. Because currently, we have no way of doing so. This should be a block here. There's no way he saves both his shields just to let his Clefable die. Yeah, for not. Okay. We are blocking this. 
Um, Dragonite, Clefable, I wonder what his last Pokemon is. Hopefully something we can take down. Now, this will be his second shield. Meaning we will get the first um, Dragon Claw off against Dragonite. Because we will block the next move. If Dragonite even gets one, this might actually kill. So we're not doing too bad. Even even this, right? We're still we are in a bad position, but we're not at the same time. Because Giratina would lose to this Dragon Claw. And we just need to make sure we get the next Dragon Claw off, which is now, which is good. Obviously, Dragonite nearly died, so I probably could have got a normal attack off. But the amount of times I've fought that, and then we've been, like, sucker punched. Um, isn't great. Oh, we nearly got that. Um, okay, so that's Clefable down. We just got to hope the next Pokemon they bring out is weak to water or ice. If it's weak to water or ice, we are good to go. What's that for alligator? It's not. Oh, you see, he wanted to do the same as what we were doing. So it was, he's obviously got Hydro Cannon and Ice Beam. So we got big damage off there. Hmm. I think that's two Hydro Cannons, which means we lose this. Unless he's going to go for... Oh. Okay. I was wrong. Crunch might be his fastest move, which is why he keeps going for it. But it is doing nothing to us. So this should be another win. We've not really lost a fight in a while. And it's really good for us. However, like I said, we are weak to grass. Very much weak to grass. So we will have to try and figure out a team that is maybe not weak to a lot of things. Um, grass is one of our weaknesses. All right, guys. So as you can see there, we are halfway to level 19. And we won five out of five there, which is really good. Um, what I'm wanting to do is get Giratina a third move. We are a few um, candies away yet. But we should get there soon. I'm hoping we get there soon. Um, I keep forgetting to go and do my free raid for the day. So we don't have any like other content to show. Which is a shame. Um, also, my camera is kind of like on an angle. So I'm trying to look at my stream, which is over here. Not stream, but videos over here. Then look at my gameplay, which is straight ahead. Um, oh, a Vaporeon. Nice. Um... The only thing we've got is the Algato is slightly behind. So when I'm looking at the screen in front of me, it's a bit like, it's about uh, 30 milliseconds behind. Which isn't too bad, but it's also not great at the same time. What move is this going to be? Aqua Tail. Yeah, okay. Oh, actually, we might lose first. So we are going to swap out here. Vaporeon's actually a very good one. This might be our first loss. Oh. Decidui. Okay. We... I think we lose this. Vaporeon's a very powerful mon. Decidui is a very powerful mon. Um, and it's already taken us down. Yeah. We're in a bad spot. Ooh. That might be clutch. If he doesn't block this, it's clutch. But I think he's going to block. Yeah. So. I think this is going to be Spirit Shackle. Yeah, it was. Um, so a good thing that we blocked there. Now, we take Decidueye down. And unfortunately... We are still in a bad position. I'm going to have to block. We're going to be one Pokemon for one, but Vaporeon's got more health than Swampert. Which is a bad sign. 
Um, if he brings Vaporeon straight out, it can... Oh, Primarina. Okay. Okay, Hydro Cannon this. Now, we know Primarina doesn't have um, Hydro Cannon yet, which is a really good one. Like, that attack fell. Doesn't need to be there. Now, we just need to get this down as far as possible. Obviously, knowing that Givatina is a dragon. Right. I'm hoping we didn't get hit and we should be able to take Vaporeon down from here. If this kills. It didn't kill. Of course it didn't. Ooh, we might be in a good position here. Just depends on how much Dragon Claw does. We might have looked this. Um... Maybe we might have just done it, or we might just lose here with one Aqua Tail. I don't know. We luck that fight. That is really good and really bad at the same time. We did not have an answer um, to that Vaporeon. That Vaporeon took so much Swamp of Health down. But that's where I'm going to leave this video. Thank you all for watching. Please leave a like. Comment down below if you think this team's good. Um, we did have a comment on the last video saying that we are weak to dark, which is why I swapped out for the Polyrath, and it does seem to be working okay. Um, Polyrath does take a long time to build up its moves, though, so maybe we will swap this out. Um, but other than that, please subscribe to the channel if you are new, and I'll speak to you all in the next one.